uh, a topic that people are so very uncomfortable about and stuff, but it's very much important that as a, as a youth program, we discuss all matters that are uh, youth-based, I mean, things that are affecting young people, health, education, religion. I mean, we, we have a 360 look at, at all of all of these things. And it's, it's, it's important that we... Well, I wanted to give you something, I mean, a brief about um, gonorrhea. It says that uh, gonorrhea is a sexually transmitted bacterial infection that if untreated it may lead to inf oh wow gonorrhea can lead to infertility i'm, I'm just finding this this, this 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 alarming and and it says that um this is how gonorrhea uh spreads so that by having unprotected vaginal anal or oral sex by a mother to baby by by pregnancy okay so gonorrhea it actually can transmit from a mother to baby uh, during pregnancy, labor, and also nursing symptoms. It says that symptoms include painful urination, abnormal discharge from the penis or the vagina. Um, men may experience testicular pain. Seana, as a Oshwayo Yakakrana se Bibisa. And women may experience pain in the lower abdomen in some cases gonorrhea has no sin I mean, this is a very important topic i mean um sorry for the, the the local dialect but i wanted those at home in the rural communities to understand how all of this is we have a very young person to also have that discussion you know people get confused whether or not gonorrhea is the same as white remember when we when we were kids and we were in school when people eat toffee they would tell you oh Berman no the toffee sound you are going to get white is that the same as gonorrhea uh, uh uh she's gonna the nurse is gonna help us get the proper understanding and also, is it true that toffee, sweet biscuit, um, chewing gum, those sweet, sweet things, is it is it is it really the case that those also uh, can give um, how do you call it, uh, gonorrhea? We'll be looking at all of those things. Now, treatment is it something that can really be treated, or uh, because it's, it's, it's a sexually transmitted um, bacteria, bacterial infection, or whatever it may be, so it, it becomes, uh, I mean, it, it it cannot be cured, or all of that. We will be looking into that very well how does somebody get to know if he or she has gonorrhea i mean she will be helping us understand all of that and also um how how fast does it spread does it spread like a, a, a coronavirus do you cough when you have gonorrhea however if you're a boy or a girl and you have gonorrhea and you're watching and you want to use yourself as a case study to help people understand you can send us a message with your experience and she can also help to get you guys understand now symptoms I think I've read a sense of treatment. Is that gonorrhea can be treated with antibiotics? Oh, then that, that's that's that, that's okay. All right. They said that. What are the four signs symptoms of gonorrhea? So we are looking at this document before uh, we go into the discussion proper. Uh, five minutes into the show, we'd open the phone line so that all those who have questions on that would 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 be able to answer symptoms of gonorrhea. This one says that greater frequency or agency of urination, and the next one is that a pulse-like discharge or drip from your Penis. This discharge could be yellow, white, beige, or greenish. Hey, green. <laughs> okay. Right. This one says that discoloration and swelling at the penis area. This one says that testicular swelling or pain. That's what I was saying. Testicular. Those who are who may not understand that. I'm talking about your boss, like uh, 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 yeah, uh, yeah. The next one is itching and soreness in your anus. Another one is rectal bleeding and discharge. Now I'm going to open the phone lines at the moment before we welcome her. Okay, before she comes to the discussion. Tell us your experience with gonorrhea. Uh, uh, if you have any questions on that, so that when she comes, we can ask all of them. Or you have an experience you want to put across on gonorrhea. Are you having certain like like I mean very very likely symptoms and and, and 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 all of that? The men and women, young people who have been moving from one girl to another. If you're a boy, you move from this girl to more the other girl. If you're a, 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 a how do you say? If you're a, a boy, a girl to and you move from this man to another. This man. If you keep moving around, there's a high probability of you putting yourself in danger to have this discharge listen to that if you are not scared some of you must have fear of god some of the discharge says that it could be yellow so if you're a man and you have a yellow discharge yellow yellow yeah this this gold or yellow something like this dripping from 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 your pen oh please don't call the test line i want you to call the studio lines we'll, we'll put the studio lines on the screen very very soon so that you call so the calls that are coming on the phone please please call us on the um phone lines that will be displayed very soon this one says that 
no let me not read this message it says that another discharge that can come is uh greenish so if you're a man and you see some green fluid coming it is not good for you as a young person. You need to see. You need to see a medical professional to to have that discharge. And this is very interesting. Testicular swelling or pain when you are there, you see that. that how do we even say that in our local dialect? Because we're educating people on gonorrhea. Uh, what's it? Oshawa, you know, or you have swollen uh, uh, balls or there's pains inside. You 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 must check it out if it's gono or something like that. Itching and soreness uh, uh, in your anus area. And, and deep inside, rect, rectal bleeding. That's a, maybe, okay, she would, she would help us understand the rectal bleeding and this. Child. So some can bleed and all of that. I said, in the case of female, they would have some creamish. Ish. Hey, who's that? <laughs> right, call us on the numbers you find on your screen so that we can connect you uh, before we move to the we move to the discussion proper so that you can have a chance to be part of the show. If you're watching on Facebook, don't forget to click the like button, share, and drop a comment beneath the comment section or send us a message on 0548503799, 0548503799. The display you are finding on your screen is giving you the same the the the, the symptoms and the signs of gonorrhea. There's abdominal pain, there's pain when you are having intercourse so if you're a young person and you are married and you realize that there's always some pains and i want to ask the nurse when when when, when we start a conversation is the pains going to be felt by the lady or is going to be felt by the man and 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 stuff and he says that it can also um go oh please i don't know if we have okay good so please don't call in our whatsapp numbers please call 030-2791-326 if we can check the speakers in the studio so that we can uh, uh, uh pick some calls here because i've seen people call our our whatsapp um numbers at the moment so please make sure that you um get it okay 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 all right all right so 030 Three two six zero three zero two seven nine one three two six. Uh, send us a message on what you think about all. Okay, we have a caller on the line. Hello, good afternoon. Yeah, good afternoon, sir. Your name and where you're calling us from, sir? Yeah, I'm calling from North Kanishi. Right, let's hear you yeah, from North. Is, K yeah, my name is Bright. Let, let Let's hear you from North K. Yeah, I said sometimes. Uh, my this thing, that, that, Oshua, Oshua, Bana, Tomna, Okano. Uh huh. Uh -huh. Sometimes, me Philippine, only my acting, na, my acting, only na, hey. yane, we me, me. Why are you saying that? Yeah. Mm, Mate, of course, you were my to her. Nurse, then you start the interview now. You be busama, why? Ah, okay. 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 Okay, call us on zero three zero two seven nine one three two six. We are having, we are having, I mean, detailed education for young people. This is the health segment on Youth Empowerment Television Show. We are discussing gonorrhea symptoms and uh, 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 causes, and we'll look at the treatments and all of those things too as well. So uh, call us on zero three zero two seven nine three two six make sure that you call us and then we'll connect the phone lines for uh, uh you to speak with us call us so that we can have but you can also say if you are shy to speak on phone <laughs> you can send us a message on zero five four eight five zero three seven nine nine zero five four eight five zero three seven nine nine what's a message text message we do our best to read it for you as well if you're watching us out of ghana at the country code is plus two three three five four eight five zero three seven nine nine so that we can have a very very lovely conversation with you okay let me come on whatsapp and see what are some of the messages okay we have another caller hello good afternoon no, you, hello good afternoon hello good afternoon yeah good afternoon your name and where you're calling us from sir uh, my name is joe all right joe let's hear you president Unfortunately, we have lost Joe on the line, so we, we couldn't get Joe on the line. So 
0826. Um, keep keep your conversations coming on WhatsApp on 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 on, on everywhere. All the lines that we have we have announced so that we can uh, get the conversation going here on the show. So uh, keep them coming. Somebody sends me a very interesting message, and I had, I don't know how I'm able to how I'm able to read this uh, on TV. Anyway, let me let me. I think I'll take it from the top. Then I come to the down. This one says that boss, I love your vibe and your motivation. I'm Oscar from Salt Pond inside, and you didn't bring the inside. Uh, this one says that hello sir, please. My nipples have been hurting. Is this symptoms of bone? <laughs> <laughs> I feel I know this person. <laughs> hey, Mosu. Right, 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 right. Okay. 0548 You can also uh, call us on the numbers you find beneath the screen so that we can have the conversation at the moment. So, I'm sure all of you are ready. So, we will be having that particular discussion. But what the guy was saying... Ah... Uh, well, let me look at some of the symptoms of, um, um, okay, we have, we have a call on the line. Hello, good afternoon. Hello, good afternoon. Hello, good afternoon. Yeah, hello, good afternoon. Your name and where you're calling us from, sir? Uh, I'm Joe, calling from San City. Oh, let's hear you from San City. Uh, I'm referring to my, my boy. You, you say you've been named what? I said... Uh, you've, been, you've been feeling pains in your balls. Yes, I've been feeling two pains in my balls. Oh, in the left ball, the right ball, both of them. I did the right ball. The right ish, possibly. Yeah. Mm, mm, mm. Okay, we'll, 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 we'll see if yeah. Emily or Adipa can help us uh, understand yeah, that. Yeah. Right, right. She, 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 she'll be answering that for you. She would, she would let you. She'll be answering that for you. Yeah, yeah, okay. she, she, she'll be answering okay. that for you. Okay. Right, right. It looks like a lot of these young people, a lot of the men have problems with their balls. Uh, she will help us understand. I don't know. Let, let us also know your symptoms here <laughs> on Youth Empowerment Television Show. But let's look at some of the symptoms. The ladies are not calling. It looks as if now, 2022, gonorrhea is only a problem to men. We are very happy that women are free from that. So that's good news. Okay. Okay. This one says that symptoms, symptoms in women. Uh, I have an unusual vaginal discharge, which, may, which is thin and watery, green, and sometimes yellow. It's painful and it feels like a burning sensation when passing urine. And I have a lot of pain and bleeding after sex. Is this gonorrhea or what? Hey, madam. I said, what symptoms need now will be you. It's not easy. It's not easy. It's not easy. Um, right, 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 right. Okay, good. So, um, she's here. And we are going to have a very, very short interview. Unfortunately, our time is, is, is fast spent. Uh, so, we would go straight into the discussion. I'm trying to get to Facebook and see some of the comments that, that are there on Facebook for us to read. But um, I'm still, I'm still, uh, it's, it's, it, it still gets loading and, and, and all of that. I'm going straight into the discussion so that we can, we can get going. You're welcome. Thank you. mm, you're late. Yeah. But, but we'll still go on anyway. So if you've just joined us, uh, we have our guest already seated in the studio. She's going to have a very, very quick... Uh, um, so your, your name? Emily. 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 Okay. You're a nurse, right? Yes. Or you're a nursing student? Or? No, I graduated last year waiting to write my license before I start practicing as a nurse. Okay. 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 That is fine. That is fine. I'm sure you've, you've done your clinicals and other things at hospitals and all of that. Yeah. Right. Right. Gonorrhea, is it something we should be really scared of or it's a normal thing? Gonorrhea isn't a normal infection. Mm. It can cause a whole lot of damages um, in women and both men too. But if I'm also the anchor, gonorrhea is not bad. Okay, so mm. gonorrhea can, untreated gonorrhea can lead to infertility in both women and men. Men. So uh, it's mm. very necessary to treat it when you contract it. Wow. Wow, wow. Where, where did it come from? We know HIV came from chimpanzees and all of Do we have medical records of, of where it comes from? Okay, so gonorrhea is called by, uh, caused by a bacteria. Okay. And the bacteria is called Neisseria uh, gonorrhea. Huh? 
Lizeria. 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 Gonorrhea. Gonorrhea. Okay. Yeah, that's um, the cause, the bacteria that causes gonorrhea. Okay. But we have other risk factors that um, can can predispose a person to get the gonorrhea. Okay. And some of the risk factors are having multiple sexual partners mm. and having unprotected sex as well. Okay, so so we, we so two having multiple uh, sexual, sexual partners, partners and having um, uh, um, uh, how do you call it um unprotected unprotected sex. sex. Yeah. So quickly on the first one, having multiple sexual partners. If you if you wear a condom for all of them, would you get gonorrhea? Only if the condom works. Oh, only if the condom works. Yeah. So the, sometimes condom doesn't work. Okay, what I know is most people do not check expiry dates and other things. Condom has expiry date. It does. Hey. <laughs> So, um, if you don't check any time expire during the process, you can't hear. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Okay. But but let's let's get it this way. So it means that even as young people, I mean, educating young people, they have to check expiring date of, of condoms yeah, and yeah. all of that. But we don't advise anybody to have multiple sexual partners. I think it's very demonic. It's not good, <laughs> and you guys must abstain from that. But come to think about it, um, our our our. I mean, our, our, should I say our grandparents, our forefathers? Our if forefathers. people still do, you know, they have some, can even marry as many as four wives, yeah. three wives. These are multiple sexual partners. Yeah. The mere yeah. fact that you're having multiple sexual partners, both of you don't have gonorrhea. Is it that because it's multiple and the man is working extra on, I mean, sexually, the person gets gonorrhea? Okay, so you having multiple sexual partners, you know, against it, but I have to do the needful. Mm. by getting yourself tested and your partners even if you contract the gonorrhea mm -hmm. while treating yourself you also have to treat your partner if you have more partners you have to treat all of them as well so a man has gonorrhea and he has 10 girlfriends he, he has would, to treat he has all, to of tell them. all of them that yes. he has given all of them gonorrhea. yes because treating one leaving nine behind is cost 90. why because you treat you yourself still you still go get... back and contract it so it's not like maybe coronavirus where maybe the body develops antigens or develops no. it gets used to gonorrhea the body cannot get used to it no mm. we only use antibiotics to treat it so whilst treating even in the process of um, treating you have to abstain from sex within that period okay. until you are done with your treatment how long does gonorrhea treatment takes okay it takes um um, 14 days to it depends on the duration of the medication the mm -hmm. antibiotics they will give okay. you okay. so in the process after you complete your treatment mm -hmm. you have to give yourself seven days mm. free from sex then you go back and get tested again to see that gonorrhea is no more hey. before you are free to have unprotected sex with your partner wow so how do you check yourself if you don't have gonorrhea is there a special test to, to check that it's not anything special it's the normal test we go through uh, what's that normal you can test? take urine sample you can take swab if if you got your gonorrhea through anal sex we will take oh, anal sex can give gonorrhea yes gonorrhea is contracted through sex be it anal vagina or oral sex o oral sex what yeah. if you say oral sex what does it mean like a man licking a woman or something like that or a woman giving a blowjob or what, what yeah, is that? a woman giving a blowjob okay mm -hmm. but, but the man licking a, that one doesn't doesn't if the woman has it he, he can also contract it but, but how through the mouth yeah oh, the yeah, mouth can get gonorrhea yeah because the science and sentence we have so truth so if you contract it through oral sex, you get so true as a sign and symptom. But you're a medical professional. Is it advisable for people to even be doing oral or oral sex? Okay, to me personally, I'm against it. You're against it. Okay, 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 very well. So, at how fortunately, we just have four minutes, but we'll manage the four minutes very, very, very well and, and see what we can do. Another question I want to ask is that, hey, has there been a case where gonorrhea has been treated and it doesn't go? No. Do we have if severe... you stick to the medication? If you take it religiously, mm. it will go. Okay. So if you take if you're on medication yeah. properly, it, it, it will if go. If you take it religiously, it will I, go. I want to ask this, and because this is a, in a situation yeah. that the, you treat and it doesn't go means some of your partners elsewhere, you've infected them without treating them. So you but, still go back and contract it. But I'm, 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 I, this is very, very serious. Has there been cases where a girl can have about, a woman can have about four boyfriends or, or four sexual partners? Yes. There are instances like that? Yes. Okay, the, the, the last time you personally had that experience, how many boyfriends did you have? 
Okay, it was two. You had two boyfriends? Yes. Okay. And how did you manage them very well? Okay, we advised her to bring them to the oh, I was talking about you yourself. Me, right? myself. Yeah. No. She didn't understand my question. <laughs> no. <laughs> okay, so for, no. The, for the girl was able to confess to you that she had two boyfriends. Yes. And you were able to advise her to bring them to the facility for to choice. bring the two of them together not together. to bring them one by yes. one but you guys are professional you won't tell the other one that no that's her privacy if she approves to that we'll go but if she doesn't we'll do as as she wishes it's gonna wear the same as white no cardiodiasis is also sti but it's not the same as so bono is not white no people used to say white is normal even a child can have white and stuff is it the same as gonorrhea? Is it, okay, is it so something normal? People say why it is normal because in women we have this normal vaginal discharge. Yeah. But it doesn't smell. So when people see that discharge, they, they classify it to be white and they will start taking all this sort of medication to treat it. Mm. But most of them are normal in women. But when you uh, in a situation where you have this vaginal discharge, that stinks, have some offensive smell and it has color, that's when you have to be prompted or you have to go to the hospital to get checked up to see what exactly the type of STI that you've contracted. Mm, mm, mm. Now, in the mail, before you came, I was trying to speak to some people on phone. Does gonorrhea affecting men give them problems with their balls? Like yeah, their balls it head? makes it swollen, then it feels warm to touch. Mm. How is the warmness like? It's as warm as you, when you feel it, you you know. Mm. Did it burn your hand when you held it? No, off? it doesn't burn, but you feel it. Okay, you felt it in your yeah. hand? Yeah. Okay, okay. It's it's inflammatory process, mm. so... Okay, all right, all right. A another question that a caller called is that, did you, did, uh, does the pain move from the, um, the scrotum to the anus for a man too as well? Do they have uh, that's maybe if um he contracted it through anal sex okay he would definitely have um pain from the anus and um probably will be bleeding as well does yeah. it does it cause pain during sex yeah it does in women in women yeah they feel pain to they will probably feel it uh, they will feel what pain because of the scrotal swelling Okay. Yeah. Okay. How does one, and let's look, let, that will be the last thing to discuss. How does one prevent? Because, for example, thankfully, I have never experienced that before. Have you, have you experienced gonorrhea before? No, really. Who would even confirm that <laughs> on national TV? <laughs> I, I haven't. If you, I you, have, you I would have used it to educate others. Okay. Yeah. You would have. You would have. It's okay. not a shameful thing. Oh, really? Yeah. That somebody gave you gono? It's not a shameful thing. Would you break up with your husband or boyfriend if he, you realize he gave you gono? No. If your girlfriend gives you gono, you don't advise the boy to leave the girl. No. Why? Why would you advise? I mean, she slept around, sex, and she brought it. If if um the, he or she is going around sleeping with multiple partners, mm. you, you only offer your advice, but you can't just tell the person to leave. It's a okay. personal choice. Okay. Right. Right. Okay. I think. Uh, let me see if we don't have any message. That I would uh, see what I I can do on the. On, on it um, mm, 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 mm. okay okay this one says that ask her if bad odor from the vagina also is caused by gonorrhea bad odor okay, like so smell the, the bad odor it might not be gonorrhea but it might be any type of the sti so okay. the best thing is for you to go to the hospital and get checked out okay it's okay. not every discharge that um mm. yeah not not every every, every, every discharge. discharge not th that that gives it okay right any any advice or, or something you want to uh, uh give across as far as this is concerned okay so the only advice i can give is safe sex you have to use condom did you say safe sex they yes. have to use it? why should they have sex <laughs> oh it's a normal thing so you can't uh, did you say sex is a normal thing yeah okay why is sex a normal thing because human beings we have feelings oh so you yeah. have feelings yeah i do have feelings and which i know you also had so who me yeah yeah i do have uh -huh. <laughs> okay very well um
I, I don't know if, if, if this is where my producer wants me to end the show, but um, uh, with some of the messages are very, very interesting. They, they, they are asking if gonorrhea, like white kids can have gonorrhea, can kids also have babies have? Okay, pregnant mother can transfer it to the infant during delivery. That's okay. if the mother has it and she does not treat it before. Okay. 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 This person. It, it is a necessity for every pregnant woman to get tested for gonorrhea. Okay. For for this one, I want you to answer it yourself. Can you read it to the camera so you it's answer? oral sex. The good. person wants to know if oral sex is good. A medical professional is oral sex good. First of all, can you tell us what oral sex is and if it's good or not? Oral sex simply means having sex through the mouth. The mouth. Yeah. Okay. Mm. And I I I I would I would say no. It's not good. <laughs> oral sex is not good. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Because, um, medically. Medically. Okay. Because if the person has any... But um, pleasurably, what about it? That's a personal choice. <laughs> oh, so that would be a personal decision for yeah. people to make. Okay. So medically. So mm -hmm. if you're having sex with a person orally and the person has any type of STI, it can even inflame your tonsils. And I don't know if you do know much about tonsil. What was that? We have this... <laughs> Compo. No, it's a compo. No, it's not compo. Okay. It's a gland. You have some veins? Two. No. It's inside the mat. If you open your mat, you see. Yeah, you, you see some things. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. In the, in yeah. The... So it can be inflamed. Oh, when... but, 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 but that thing is long in the throat. It's ah. not long. I mean, from, from the mouth to that thing, it's a bit long. Oh. It's not long. A man it's... cannot get it unless maybe... A woman would rather Each get and it. every person has tonsils. Yeah, I know. But then a woman would, would get infected. That thing can get infected with a woman more than a man. Oh? It's not urethra. Are you sure? Yeah. Uh -huh. It's urethra that women... Our urethra is short, shorter than men. Uh, yeah. the, the reason why I'm asking that is that... Are you saying that that is where the infection starts? No, but if the person has infection, they have oral sex... It can affect your tonsils. Can blowjob affect the tonsils? That's if the person has infection. Okay, so if the person has no infection and you keep having that, I mean, there's blowjob and all of that, it, it can, nothing will happen? Not that I know of. <laughs> okay, okay, but, okay, right. Uh, we, we have to go, we have to go, unfortunately. <laughs> but, but this person says that, um, uh, it says that, doctor, it says, Dr. George, I love your conversation. I used to, I used to treat it with, uh, herbs. Do you prescribe herbal treatment to gonorrhea? Do you know Dr. George? No. Okay. I know nurses and doctors that you are very good friends. <laughs> uh, okay. This was like, when, when, when your urine is splitting into two and the head of your penis is swollen, is it gono? Okay, so it may be, it may or may not be gono, mm -hmm. but it may be any other type of the STI. Mm. Okay, this one says, like, Can you get Gono through food? I like food, but I mean, he likes a lot of food. Can he get it through Gono? <laughs> no, please. Food cannot give Gono. Kissing, does kissing give Gono? No. You have oral sex and maybe you have the infection and you're kissing somebody, you can't. Not get... that I know of that. Okay. You can contract it through kissing. Okay. Okay. Can WC, like, can... okay, let me read it very well so I get it. Can go into the washroom, public washroom. Somebody who has gonna use it and you go there, can you get it through? Okay, so that's the mentality we had growing up, but it's not a uh, scientifically approved. Ah, so those girls who always go and pee and use tissue to some <laughs> stand, they are wasting their time. It's not time waste, but it's what you have to do it if there are other bacteria also on the seat okay, to kill it. Okay. But not For that gonorrhea. gonorrhea, it's not scientifically approved that okay. even sharing boxes, towel. With Pants. an infected person, you can contract it. I see. But you may contract any other type of STI. Like, like the white or, or, or those things? Maybe. Maybe. Mm, mm, mm. Uh, wow, 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 wow. I'm just waiting for the signal to, for, for me to know if our time is up because we started about just 10 minutes ago. So uh, this one says that, boss, please ask her. Please ask her. Oh, but this her, this, this is quite personal. Very, very, very personal. So, okay. If your part, if if your partners, if you say partners, okay. If your, one. Yeah, it says if your partners don't have gonorrhea, can you then go ahead to have oral sex? And is it medically approved? <laughs> Do you work with MBA? Okay. I will advise the person to consult his or her doctor. To, to consult a doctor. Eh? Yeah. Mm. Because you do not have personal experience on those oral, no. right? 
Okay, sure. Um, this person also says that, please ask her if I can walk to a normal pharmacy to get myself medicine uh, treatment for gonorrhea or, or I have to go straight to the... I think you want to say hospital. Hospital, okay. Yeah. It's not advisable to be buying unprescribed medication because if you come to the hospital, there are some process that will take you to. We even had to um, prescribe some medications to you based on your body weight and some other vital signs that we take from you. So the fact that um, someone contracted the infection and he or she went to uh, buy medication from the pharmacy to treat her, him or herself and it worked, doesn't mean it's going to work for you. And when you come to the hospital, they will prescribe some medication to you. We will take you through education counseling for you to understand it well. So it's always better for you to go to the hospital, talk to your daughter. There is nothing to feel shy about. It's a normal thing. Gonorrhea, no, but, but gonorrhea. But, but gonorrhea, dear, people, you feel shy. Then you are coming to the hospital. We have some what other, we have, 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 we have some other um, STI conditions which are more than gonorrhea. I don't know if you've heard of what. What's what? Ah, uh, what? Uh, Bob what? No. What's that? Maybe, genital what? Genital what? Yeah. What was that? It grows and around your genital like um, carifla. Huh? By that, it's not in Ghana. It's like monkey. It's in Ghana. Like. Have you seen some before? Yeah, I treated some. Was it last three months? Oh, yourself? Yes. You had some? No, I treated a patient. A patient? Yeah. Okay, 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 okay. And did it went? You don't know as the history yeah, as now. I don't know as But is it curable? Does that become curable? Mm, no, it's. It may be, but I, it's I, manageable. I, I think next week we have to really have a discussion on... Um, genital what? The what? The genital <laughs> what? Ah, so when somebody have, have it, you can't do anything, eh? You can't yeah, have you sex can. or anything. No, it's very nasty. You can't stand it. Oh, God. But it's only, it's only females, right? Male, female. Male to have the what? Yeah, the person I treated was a male. Hey, you know what? Hey, wow. <laughs> Then that's good. Me, I don't think I can allow my girlfriend to, to be a nurse. I can't stand it. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways. Right. This is where time will permit us. Your final words to young people on this camera. Just advise them on, okay, on gonorrhea. So, um, the best advice I can give you is to abstain from sex if you're not married or you're not preparing to get married. The best thing is to abstain from sex and stick to one partner if you can't abstain and all, always have um, protected sex because I know in our generation I can't tell you to just do without sex yeah so that's all I have um, for now I mean yeah the generation they can't do without sex but um I think it's also the, the fourth fault of the we'll discuss that later. <laughs> <laughs> right. Thank you so much. Um Emily Adepa. Yeah. Right. Right. It's, it's such a pleasure to have you here. I'm I think we'll make a deeper research on the what and let's discuss that next week. This is where time will permit us. Ten minutes after two on another edition of Youth Empowerment Television Show. My name is Richmond Amofa Sapon. This is the last edition of Youth Empowerment TV for this week. We'll be back next week with uh, with more and more discussion on um on, on things that that is affecting young people and inspires young people as well let me say a prayer say some for me we always come here to do this for god and country bye bye African. Hello, information. But ask. Me, I have still not got the money for that list of expensive building materials you sent to me. The price of the iron rods have been increased too much, had I? But now, relax. Look, that's not why I even called you. I just visited IPCD. Where the engineers told me everything about your circle fast floor. Chawanko, please, those people are expensive. Are they not the people building those big, big houses in town? 
Madam, um, in fact, I used to think the same of until I visited their office today and they gave me an estimate of how much it will cost. No more! The estimate is free! Oh. It's cheaper than the one I even sent you! Wow! Building contractors, foremen, masons, visit IPCP, the Trasaco Fast Floor. Engineers will assist you build an affordable, faster, and stronger building. Oh, madam, madam, <laughs> it is done. Wow! Oh, Trust cycle fast floor, stronger, faster, and affordable. This is a Trasaco Estates. Home to Accra's most beautiful and luxurious homes presents its newest addition, Trasaco Springs, a premium master plan community of service plots. Surrounded by an exhaustive list of amenities. The gated community of Tema to Accra Motorway presents you the finest opportunity to own a land that suits your preferred size, budget, and payment terms. Tasako Springs is open to you for development. Our on site sales executives are ready. Call on 055 659 2658. On the second reach, Cape Coast, Ghana. For more information, contact plus 233 031 200 3222. Email admin at reachwayahotel.com.gh. Reachwaya Hotel, richly inviting, comfortably yours. We look forward to welcome you soon. Your half and full day conference. Let us gladly cater for your guests. Visit our website. When the troubles come your way, when the troubles come your way, email us. When the troubles come your way, for your booking and reservation, kindly call us on 031 200 3222. 031 200 3222. Ridge Royal Hotel, richly inviting. Comfortably yours. When the troubles come. And don't think I decided true man capsules and so a day bread. I can't think of what's up with you. What's up with Especially, yeah, you're 40 years and above. No, a fire prostate at home, over to me, your prostate enlargement, and as the prostatitis, so acquire Sabia, ne catch us and PSA level, echo higher. Kind of who said, Oh, prostate, no, and who you touch him. So, who said, What chim and son of Ajunso, who Junso, and a more pie, and I say, A do not draw what I do, sir, and a kind of who said, When your prostate disorder. So what to me did he? And I said what that thing in what room? And I said when you daily supplement here, a bit to me a boy, I'm a prostate, you know, a gin and an ice. So I'm very much actually we a natural link company. Ah, what made they post love capsules? Ah, a boy and very much prostate. Two man and a dinner capsules. A boy and buy a feature call. Over to me a from. This advertisement has been vetted and approved by FDA. Hello, baby! It's me, I, Boga I. What feel you now? Hey! What for me? Oh, what about that? Oh my god! Let's try wrong me. I'm a. We are a fearful fucker, go! Brother, we are funny. You hear root alive. Okay, root alive. Root a natural product here. I am a tropical herb CEO. In the water here. Root a life. I want to watch you fat here. Fume. No way. Cleanse the system. No. My karma. Romantic. Kaide. Root a mixture. Otum some malaria. In a root a titanic. Oka root a life. I want to make them painful. I need a painful. Hello. What are you doing Tuesday to Friday? Let Wednesdays are for book reviews. Thursdays are for the hard talk, those social, economic, policy oriented, political questions that demand for the tough questions to be asked. 
our personality profile in Fridays when we get to know the stories behind the winning personalities we love. Inspirational story from inspirational personalities. Hey, listen, you really cannot miss the couch with me, Amma Pratt. It's still the only TV show with a hat. My name is Harriet Nati, and this is Diplomatic Affairs. In previous seasons, he saw this. You are not allowed to hawk or preach in commercial.